Well, well, we have a wrap today. Feeling excited about it. We had our normal hiccups. The dirt we had was pretty wet, and so we weren't able to use our SR3 rake, which is unfortunate, because that thing, best grading tool I've ever used. Or, yeah. or what works in replacement is bending the dirt rake. That's right, so here you go. Second best grading machine in the entire world, bend with a dirt rake. So you're rolling along this cap and you're feeling pretty good. You got this cap stuff figured out. Then you get to a curve and it's like, oh crap, now my pieces don't work anymore. Well, you can fix it. You do need a paver saw. Um, obviously, if you just go straight, you'll run off the side of your wall. So set down your cap on the wall. Use your tape measure. Set the two points, two inches, two inches. Don't worry about the middle, it is what it is. Set your two points, get your two inches and two inches. Look at the gap it leaves, and then uh, take a level, split the difference on that gap. I have about uh, two inches of gap. So I'll come back here. Oh man, I never measured that. I just eyeballed it, two inches. And I'll take an inch off of this block and an inch off of this block. So use my level, my soapstone. Over here, boom. Now, I'll take my paver saw, my loud, noisy, dusty thing. Yeah, so as I was saying, one way your mask, this dust is dangerous. Wow. Okay. If you're really good, you can only do this once, but more than likely it'll take some fine tuning. Oftentimes I'll slide it together and I'll check to make sure that I'm at two inches. That's good, that's good. And my cut looks okay. If it needs a little bit of critiquing, sometimes if your cut isn't quite straight, it'll leave a pretty big gap there. That has a little bit of one, but it's pretty, it's small enough that it's okay. But what you can do, if it's really close, it just needs a little bit of critiquing. You can uh, start up your saw and run it push the block together. I'll do it on this one, just to show you. Push the block together. That is so nice. Nice cut, two inches, and I'm ready for the next piece. You're gonna need one of these saws with a big cap like this. If you have a two, two inch cap, this is four inch cap. If you have a two inch cap, you can get a masonry saw, a masonry blade for just a regular circular saw, and that can work. If you have a four inch cap like this, you're gonna have to get a big saw. Um, they're expensive. Your best bet is gonna be to rent one of those saws if you have curves on your wall. If it's straight, you barely need to do any cuts. Good luck on cutting curves with cap. It's a challenge. Progress from the project in Crescent, Pennsylvania. The Doosan made short work of our bank this morning. Graded that all off, and Monday we're gonna come in here and spread out topsoil, put down straw matting, and probably hydro seed. And DJ and I are working right now on getting the final grade, the last lift, about four inches of nice green topsoil in here so we can see grass on it. Before we do that, I cut my fabric always gets windy when you do this. And uh, we're gonna cover our backfill, our drainage clean stone, so that uh, dirt doesn't get down in there and eventually clog up our drainage. There we go. Now we're ready to bring in dirt on top of that. Let's get grass grown in here tomorrow morning. It'll be a green carpet, just like that. Bait. I have a green, green thumb. Green thumb? Yep. 
I can grow grass quickly. Sweet. All right, Deej, bring in some dirt. Well, well, we have a wrap today. Our hydro seed's done. I'm starting to feel it. We're getting in the groove, feeling excited about it. We had our normal hiccups, about six yards short on topsoil, so we had to get in some more dirt. But worked out nice. The dirt we had was pretty wet, and so we weren't able to use our SR3 rate, which is unfortunate, because that thing, best grading tool I've ever used. Or, it, or what works in replacement, bending the dirt rate. That's right, so here you go. Second best grading machine in the entire world, Ben with a dirt rake. So that's what we used and uh, got it all done. I would have preferred to not have to do this a second time, but uh, we did what we could. We came in and did it as efficiently as possible. We tore down the wall, rebuilt it here. The owner's as happy as he can be given the circumstances and I just talked with them guy from the township and he seems to be pleased with everything. Maybe we made all parties happy today, Deej, huh? Maybe. I'd say I it's hope, a win. I hope. I'd say it's a win. Now he can put his fence around here. He can have a nice flat spot to put his dogs out. That's what we do. Solve problems. Hey, thanks so much for watching. If you like this kind of content, we're releasing new videos every Saturday. Make sure you subscribe, hit the notification so you don't miss any of the projects, and we'll see you guys on the next one.